Hello, 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 hello. How are you people? How's everybody doing? Uh, we're gonna do this Super World because I never finished it and I really liked it. How are we all doing? Hello, Jay Buyer. Hello, Snake the Slayer. Hello, Spyro. Hello, Pork Chop. Hello, Dainty. Hello, everybody else. I hit B. God, it takes so long to get to that spot in the menu, too. I am tired of shit. Yo, I feel that. I feel that. Slept from 10.30 to 3. <laughs> Is it going to drop me off where I last left? Is it safe to use a Switch USB-C cable with a Mac plug? Where you, where'd you, what are you talking about? <laughs> I don't, I don't understand what you're doing. You hear Joe Rogan's saying Spotify in September, then going exclusively there at the end. What? Wait, is he still going to be on YouTube? That would be a massive, I, th I think... That would be a huge mistake. It's not worth the months, man. No matter what they're paying you, the eyeballs are a better investment. You'll be on YouTube until the end of the year than just the clips. That sucks! That's crazy! Well, I guess it's less work for him, too. You look so pale, or is it just the lighting? It's a little bit from column A, a little bit from column B. Oh, wait, I can do this. Damn it. Oh! Good start. The video version will still be on Spotify. That's that's a that's like Ninja going to Mixer, man. <laughs> that ain't good. There you go, baby. Oh, I, I suck at this one. Ooh. Bob's hate for the piano app inspired a video. It really did. And I was blinded by that hate because I missed the core gap. I'm really upset that I missed the core gap because I knew it existed. It's Howard Stern going from syndicated radio to Sirius XM. No, because that's leaving a sinking ship. You know? Howard, that would be like Howard Stern leaving syndicate. Well, no. Howard Stern always, he still thinks podcasts are stupid. I just want to use the official USB-C cable with a laptop or another wall plug. So it's, it's the, where'd you get the USB-C cable from? Is it the Pro Controller USB-C? Is it USB-C to USB-A? YouTube is slowly killing itself with the monetization. I don't think it is. I think, I think every creator just is 
blows it. Okay, this is gonna be a bitch. I think every creator blows it way out of proportion. And they blame everything on YouTube. And yeah, YouTube's got some BS, but like, hey man, where else can you fucking upload your videos and build a following? Instagram? Go to Instagram, though. Have a good time. <laughs> this is gonna be, this is gonna be something else. supposed to jump on that twice i'm so this is it's probably not good to just jump right into this vimeo boy apparently vimeo has originals oh, i got spin jump i'm stupid oh here's why vimeo here's why nobody will be able to take down youtube for a while or easily or at all you can have another video service like you could have vimeo you could add on-demand videos to twitch you could have instagram tv and all that nonsense but you can't have a search integrated into that video app that rivals google itself you know what i mean youtube has google search built into it so when you want to like figure out how to do something, you immediately think, oh, I'll just go on YouTube and I'll figure it out. That's because it's got search integrated so well. And when all of us freaking people make our videos, we take that, we take search into consideration. So I'm on Twitch. I'm not taking search into consideration while I'm streaming on Twitch. I don't care. I know nobody's going to find me on here because this Twitch is garbage for discovery. Same thing with Instagram. Same thing with Vimeo. I know no one's going to find me on Vimeo, you know? And that's my two cents about the whole shenanigans. Anyway, I have to make a, a Twitter video. God, I gotta... You gotta... Get up. Mm. Long form TikTok videos. I mean, TikTok. TikTok is up there, man. All right. Great. Great start. It's going to be a lot of this today, guys. <laughs> it's going to be a lot of this. So pack it in. Get ready. Grab your coffee. What? What? Thanks for the 500 bits. Ah, I screwed up already. I was supposed to refresh this. Oh, you know what? Maybe I can hit refresh on that. There, I played the bit again. Maybe now you'll you'll come up. Hey Bob, hope you are doing well. Is this the time, the same world you were playing last Mario Maker 2 stream? Uh, I think it was two streams ago. There we go. There we go. Oh God. All right, progress. Ah! Yeah! Hey Bob, saw your reaction to the Clubhouse Games trailer on Twitter. Hares and Hounds, baby. Yeah, man. I love that game that I've never heard of before. <laughs> Fuck. Oh, that was my last life. What is that emote? Do you see that on your screen? That? <laughs> Why does that happen? 
That's weird. That's weird. Hello, DJ Atkins. Beep, boop, bop, bop, bop. Boop. How's it going, guys? Twitch.tv slash Wolfdown. I'm over here doing this. Ah! And it always goes like that. Nothing bad ever happens. F fuck. I can make that a clip. Post it to Twitter. Boop. We here doing this. How's it going, guys? Boop. Boop. How's it going, guys? Twitch.tv slash Wolfdown. I'm over here doing this. Ah! And it always goes like that. Nothing bad ever happens. Right there, baby. Right there, baby. Twitter, Twitter cuts a little closer. I notice it cuts a little off the end. Boop. Fuck. Boop. Fuck. Boop. So I gotta like give it a give it just a little. Give it a little. I was watching your new emulator vid. Would you recommend an RG350 over the Pocket Go version two, considering the difference in price in the two? Uh, do you mean the RG350M? Because I've never used an RG350. So I can't recommend the RG350. Um, I think they are both fantastic devices, the Pocket Go version two and the RG350M. It really depends how badly you want to play uh, PlayStation 1 games. Also, if you like just the, if you're cool with the form factor, because the the build quality on this is much better than the Pocket Go um, version 2. And it has great thumbsticks. Mine's all dusty for some reason. Um, but... It's a lot more. It's like double the price. So you have to really want to be able to play PlayStation 1 games. Honestly, personally, I'd be cool with just the Pocket Go version 2. Because it's a pretty... That's like a really good price point, I think, for a portable emulator. Um, but if you want something premium with a nice high-resolution screen and an aluminum body and it can play PlayStation 1 games really well, then the RG350M is great. Boop. You won't be disappointed with the Pocket Go version 2. How much is that? It's like 70 bucks? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you won't be disappointed with that. Now let's see how much Twitch. Let's see how much Twitter cuts off of this. Boop. Fuck. Boop. That's perfect. I think it'll cut off more when I actually post it, though. How's it going? Boop. Yeah, it cut off. See, it cuts off. It cuts off a little bit at the end. I hate it. Ooh. Please respond. Yo, touch my no no zune. You gotta just say the question again. You're buried in the chat. <laughs> There's a lot of people here. 
<laughs> I'm going to miss you sometimes. Instead of buying something like that, I'm just modding a DS Lite to have a 4,000 milliamp hour battery instead of a 10,000. Bluetooth for audio, tactile buttons, and integrating an R4 and easy flash Omega card. LOL. Yeah, but not everybody wants to mod, you know? Some people just want to buy something and have it shipped to their house. I watched your third part charger video, so I wanted to know if it's safe to use Power A official switch USB cable. In No, no, you can't just plug it into, wait, what are you trying to charge? <laughs> are you trying to charge your switch or are you trying to charge something else? Do you not have any other USB cables laying around to charge your switch? No. Did my video get through to you at all? Don't use anything but official shit. Charge your switch. You can't half-ass it by having an official cable and not an official charger. <laughs> Have you seen the new Genki portable dock? Yes. I've seen it all. And none of it has convinced me. My son wants to stream for my, for my 2018 a MacBook Air. Is that possible? Probably uh, like garbage. It'll probably not be a good time. But uh, sh anything's possible. <laughs> Beep. Fuck my ass. How come it didn't... How come I refreshed the wrong thing? Beep. Boop. Ah, I backed off for a second. I'm going to lose this checkpoint. And I'm going to be mad. I don't know what to do. Oh, okay. Damn it. I do the whole first part again. How you doing today? I'm good. The only Kev. How are you? I have the official switch cable, but not. Okay. Did you. Okay. I get it. You have the official switch cable. That doesn't mean you have you have the right charger. It just means you have the cable. The thing that does all the stuff is the important part. You understand? Are you hearing me? How many 20 minute videos do I need to make about this stupid thing? <laughs> This is what this is why this is why I make all these. I, I you know when I was making that last video on the portable chargers, I was like, people are gonna get so sick of me talking about this, but people keep asking me all these questions and people keep bringing up all this stuff that I don't talk about in the video. So now I gotta make a video on it. And then I made that video. And I'm like, all right, I, I I hit upload, and I was like, there's no possible way. Anybody can say anything else on this topic ever again. And I looked at the comments and I was like, oh, I could have said that. Oh, I could have said that. Fuck it. I'm never looking at the comments on any of these videos again. Can I charge it using another switch? You actually can. I don't know if you should. On that little, uh, like, vault meter thing. What the? On that little voltmeter thing that I have, there's an arrow pointing which way the charge is going. And when the switch is fully charged, the arrow goes the opposite direction. <laughs> you need to do power banks now? No, I'm not. We're not going down that rabbit hole again. I, re I absolutely refuse. 
Can I charge my Switch using a science fair potato battery? You can do anything that you put your mind to. Should you? Oh, okay. Personally, I only charge my Nintendo Switch on a hamster wheel. Why is he not going all the way over now all of a sudden? Hi, VG Dad. How you doing? Beep, beep. Can we go all the way? Thank you. Thank you. Fuck. You went too all the way. Have you noticed the Switch consoles since the... Have you noticed the Switch consoles since the pandemic? Are you asking if they've been in stock? Because no. I haven't noticed anything. I got... I mean, I got a coral one, but it was kind of luck that I was able to get one. Bob, can I charge my Switch on the 3DS charger? Yes, you just have to mash it in there. Yeah, sorry, I need to get one for my son he, who now wants to play Animal Crossing. Um, I got one in a bundle on GameStop.com. Uh, it came with Smash Brothers, which, you know, I had already, but I wanted the Switch Lite, so I just bought another copy of Smash Brothers. Hey, Bob, it's safe to charge the Switch with the potato. Oh, didn't somebody make that one already? God, man. Remember when I was at the checkpoint? Remember that? Got everybody in the chat now. <laughs> when I worked at GameStop, it was right next to like a middle school. So every day at like three o'clock, the middle schoolers would like run into GameStop and just run around. And, uh,. They would, like, often, like, ask for, like, if we could, like, charge their phone and stuff. And we would say, no, fuck off. Um, one time somebody asked if I could charge their 3DS. And I was like, no, you're good. It's got charge. What you got to do is when it gets really low, you got to take it and you got to shake it. You got to get all the juice out. He goes, really? I'm like, yeah. And he picks it up and he shakes it. I'm like, you idiot. <laughs> and all of his friends laughed at him. And then I scarred him for life. <laughs> Beep. Boop. Yeep. Damn. Boop. Beep. Boop! Scoop! Oh! Ah. Eep! Now I'm gonna lose the checkpoint again! Bonus for our Switch Lite in Canada is free thumb grips. That's... Well, does it still cost the same amount? Because that's pretty good. I had to pay, you know, extra. Flip! How long has he been streaming? All my life. In eternity. I gotta do all that crap again. Okay. 
Okay. Okay. Oh, baby. All right, all right. We're getting somewhere. Boop. Beep, bop. Boop, beep, bop. Bop. Boop. Ah! Mal. Why not put the checkpoint here, you know? Why do I gotta go through the door? Ah, I hesitated. I've had terrible posture. Beep, bop, ah, you bitch. Hank Pym! Thank you for the Twitch Prime sub. It's Wednesday, my UK dudes. Don't say that. I have so much to do before Wednesday. Ah, we may- Oh, I'm supposed to hit him twice. Can I pull a rally? <laughs> That's annoying. Oh, God. Yeet, 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 yeet. F. Supply, thank you for the Twitch prompt sub. I get paid around 3 a.m. tonight, so I get to buy Mario Maker 2. Super excited. Congratulations. Beep. <laughs> uh, I almost want to like restart every time I do that. I almost said die, but that's not what happens. Never, ever. Beep. Boop. Bop. Whoo! Trying to speed run. Eep! 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 Boop! Hey. All right. Beep, boop, bop, boop, bop, beep, boop, hit, jump, jump. Fuck you. Fuck you? Oh, shit. Come on. Oh. Flag ball me, man. Flag ball me. Oh, uh, what? What do I do here? I mean, I have to jump over. Okay, I have to jump over it. Ah, uh ha! -huh. There's no checkpoint? Okay, well, there was that. I need a hand towel, dude. Hand sweat. Jesus Christ. Za Williamson, thank you for the Twitch Prime sub. Eep boop, bop, beep. Eep. Boop, bop, beep. See, it works. It works. Fuck. I didn't, I wasn't eeping and beeping.
Not sure if you saw it, but I need to know. Do you think I can charge my switch with the... Okay. All right. I've had enough. I've had enough of you people. Just use a fucking PSP charger. And be done with it, okay? Oh! Use your Wii U tablet charger. And fucking just get it over with. Oh, I thought I wasn't going to make that. All right, we're good, we're good, we're good. Just, just yeet it, man. Keep the momentum up. I don't know what to do here. Am I not supposed No, wait. I'm so confused at that part. Is the conveyor belt going to yeet me? Because, oh, okay. Because the conveyor belt doesn't yeet me, then I don't know what's going to happen. So weird hearing him curse without the switch sound effect. Do you want to be the designated sound effect person? I'll put on a seven second delay like they do on the radio. And every time I say the fuck word, you can hit the button. Should I just take this with me? Oh, is he gonna wake up? I don't think I could jump off of him when he's down. Ah! That's what I gotta do, but I just gotta do it better. Beep, boop, bop, beep, bop, boop, bop, fuck all y'all. Ha! I got too excited. I got too ahead of myself. F! I got a Momofuku milk bar. Uh, what are these called? Cake balls? Z's Glynn, no, Z's Gin says, Are you Muslim? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> What if I am? And what if I am not? That's what I want to know. What is... What... What... What happens... What do you do with that information? If I tell you one way or the other. What do you do with that? What happens in your brain with that information? <laughs> Fuck! If Bob was Muslim, he should be fasting right now. Is that what? Is that what that's about? Does somebody think that I'm a Muslim and they just saw me eat and they're like, wait, is he? <laughs> is that what just happened? If we are, if you are, then we can go to mosque. Okay. We can't go anywhere right now, right? I don't got that shit open right now. Huh, <laughs> beep, boop, bop, beep.
boop, bop, beep. Fuck. <laughs> I timed that right. You look Arabic a little, okay? Whatever. <clears throat> I think I might try a cheese. A little, a little Gouda. Yeah, I'm gonna try something. I'm gonna try a little Gouda right now. That didn't work. I thought the uh, the toad houses would respawn if I did that. Just gonna, we're just gonna do a little of that. Flip, dude. Are my stream labels already fucked up? play a level that gave you inf oh that's right there was a level that gave me infinite lives i hope he did that on purpose because that'd be cool because every game like this needs a level like that yeah baby throw that in the air come on just end the level dude all right what do i do ah oh, flip man heap hoop come on baby yes Yes. What? 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 I think that's a spring jump, and if it is, then I'm fucked. This whole thing has been pretty good with no Kaizo shit. Like, almost Kaizo shit. But no Kaizo shit. Ingy Pan won't let me read the free TMNT comic. I heard that if instead of logging in, if you just hit browse, you should be fine. Bob Rocket League stream with Greg and Jerry? No. My Rocket League. Jerry's texting me talking about buying a TV. He's got to stop spending money. This man. Does your dad call you and Will son one and son two for laughs or does he really not know your names? <laughs> he thinks he's funny. He thinks he's hysterical. Flip! You got this, Bob. This has got to be one of the last one. Otherwise, the maker is Satan. It really is bullshit. It's too many checkpoints, dude. He 
You said the F word? Yeah, flip. Boop. Bop. Boop. Okay. I'm getting a phone call. Don't fucking call me! I am streaming. Okay, bye bye. <laughs> Goodbye. Fuck. I mean, flip. I mean, switch click sound effect. Fuck. I was trying to tell Jerry. Jerry's trying. Never mind. I don't want to. <laughs> He's trying to buy a TV. <laughs> and I just, I just, like, I wrote out a whole bunch of stuff. I was like, why are you buying a TV? And then he, like, made all these reasons. And I wrote out all, but just now I was just writing out a whole bunch of stuff. And then I was like, okay. <laughs> I just deleted everything and I wrote, okay. Boop! Ba! Alright, this is a bitch now. Watcha! Yeah! Now, this, I don't know what I'm. Oh, I do know what I'm doing. Fuck! <laughs> That's what I'm doing. I gotta do that, but I gotta do it in one foul swoop. Jerry needs a financial advisor. Here's the problem with that is that financial advisors cost money. And people who need them the most cannot afford them. Really though, I bought our TV for this apartment before we moved. I bought it, uh, well, we moved, like, towards the end, of, like, the very end of November. And I bought it, uh, on a Black Friday deal. Wait, no, did, wait, I don't remember. I'm pretty sure I got it shipped to my house, like, my parents' house. And then I moved it with all of Sam's stuff, I think. Am I wrong? I might be wrong. I think I'm wrong. I don't remember what happened. I remember I bought it, like, right around when we were moving. I bought some stuff to be shipped to my house, and then I moved it with Sam's stuff. But... I don't... I don't remember about the TV. I don't remember if I bought it... The week we moved, or what? Fuck. Yeet! Wrong. I'm Jerry Meehan. Wrong. <laughs> Jerry. I'm talking about me. I'm not talking about you. 
I don't remember when. I know I bought some stuff to be shipped to my house, like my parents' house, like the couch and shit. I, I, I did some stuff to be shipped to my house before we moved, like the week we were moving. It was shipped to my house, and then I took it with some of Sam's stuff. But I don't remember about the TV. I remember I got it on Black Friday, but I think I got it online, and I think I got it shipped here. Fuck. Here we go, baby. Mm. This is the one. This is the one. This is the one. Suck me off. <laughs> oh, I need the thing again. Ah, I need the thing! I I'm supposed to catch it. Can I meep? Can I meep? Can I yeet? Jerry, the chat watched me sit here and type a bunch of stuff to you in a text message in silence. And I just deleted all of it and wrote, okay. <laughs> oh. oh, we gotta do this whole level for like the fifth time. It's been more than five times. Let's -a go. Beep. Boop. Bop. Boop. Bop. Beep. Whatcha? Wow. Yeet. Boop. Bleep. Bop. Boop. 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 Huh. Huh. Ha. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Huah! Yeah! Yup! Ha! Huah! Yee! Yeah! Heep! Hoop! Hop! Ha! Beep! Boop! Bop! Beep! Boop! Ho oh, ho ho ho! Oh, man. Eep. Oh, now what? Ah, it's supposed to spin jump! Why is there no spin jump marker? I, I do not like mayo, no. That is true. Terry is right about that. Fuck. I gotta, I gotta use these lives. I gotta make use of these lives. I gotta not waste lives, man. I'm sweating. What did I just say? What did I just say to myself? Oh, fuck, dude. Hold on, I gotta take a picture of the dog. He's doing some dumb stuff. dog likes to he just likes to 
mush himself against the door and fall asleep, like, at the door. So he was just doing, this is what he was doing. He was, like, up against the wall, like that. What are you doing, bro? You okay, bro? Well, dude, it was a blast to see you live live. <laughs> Finally, after all these years, keep up the great work from up here in Canada. Thank you for hanging out, my guy. He must protect with his butt. <laughs> again i got like a, like a crink in my back like a kink in my back what do you call it so i got something with my back you know Did not make that. All right. All right. Oh, come on, baby. Ah! His name has a smartphone. I've just found out. Is that just as broken? <laughs> Hello, Schnauzer. A knot. That's the word I was looking for. A knot in my back. I have a knot. Mm, boop, 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 bop. Why? Why did he barely jump? Here. Oh, spin jump! Meep! Meep! Oh! What do I do? What do I do? You can't spin jump off of a... Off of a music note. What up, war? Six, eight, seven. What even is this level? This is the first level I'm playing today, too. I didn't even warm up or nothing. I just jumped right into it. <laughs> too far. No, I'm good. <laughs> Alright, here we go. I try not to rub my eyes because my hands are so goddamn sweaty. Are you stressed? I have a knot in my back that acts up when I'm stressed out. I don't ever feel stressed, but I have all these problems that people seem to associate with stress. So like, it, maybe. <laughs> so the answer is probably yes. Ah, uh, supposed to spin jump. Mm. 
I wonder if I can go back and just get a million lives. What even was the level that gave me all those lives? I just blacked out, and then I woke up and died. <laughs> Isneo has a 2.3 rating on the Play Store. I mean, it was like, really? Like, I already knew it wasn't going to be good, because it had, it had no comics on it. And then it friggin' <laughs> wouldn't load. It just wouldn't load. Also, the navigation's atrocious. It's just, it's a bad app. There's a lot wrong with it. Hello, Cor Hello Corey Guns. Boop. Ah, how did I live? How did I live from that? I totally hit the spike. Okay. Oh, I thought I wasn't going to make that. Oh, I got to jump over that. Ah! But then I can't spin. Okay. Fuck. <laughs> Are you going to be playing the wonderful 101 remaster? I don't think so. I really just do not care. Anyone know if I can link YouTube to this before I start clicking away? What are you talking about? What are we talking about? Link YouTube to what? You trying to link a, make a YouTube link? What are you doing? What are you trying to do? Tell me everything. How's your mother? Crisis Remastered? Yes, I'm definitely going to play Crisis Remastered. <sighs> the second one was the best one. Is that unanimously agreed that the second Crisis is the best Crisis? The first one's pretty good. But the second one's like fucking godly. And the third one's not very good. <laughs> That was around the time when everybody wanted, everyone was like, everyone thought cross, crossbows were cool. Or no, not crossbows, regular bows. Everyone thought regular bows were cool. So they were in every game. And every other game already ripped off Crisis so well that by then, Crisis 3 added nothing new. I remember everyone was playing Halo Reach and I felt like I was taking fucking crazy pills because I was like, this is just crisis. All these abilities are just crisis abilities. What's happening? How come nobody's talking about this? <laughs> How come nobody's talking about- Ah! Far Cry 3 and 4 and Blood Dragon had bows, right? Yes? Blood Dragon was fucking awesome. Oh. <laughs> Fangeloop. I never got into any Halo, to be honest. I'll be honest, I never really did either. I played a little bit of the 3 multiplayer and the Reach multiplayer. Um... I played like the two co-op campaign. That's like really it. I'm sure I'll play six when it comes out. I have to, oh, I gotta, I gotta hit the music note and then yeet over. 
Stream froze, so I don't know if you saw my question. I didn't. I don't... I want to get the RG350, but no one can seem to answer. A very important question. Hopefully you can. Can you play the 1992 X-Men Arcade beat-em-up on it? Probably? It has a, it has a MAME uh, emulator on it. I wasn't able to get any MAME games to run on it. But uh, if you if you've ever gotten X Men Arcade to run in a Mame emulator, then you can probably play it on there. But you'd only be able to play it with yourself. So what's the point of even playing that game? You know, it's a multiplayer game. Beep. Boop. Okay. Oh, come on. Hello, Fred. Ah, oh, I did the same thing again. Got it running somewhat decent on my Vita with f final burn alpha. I'm sure it'll be able to work on there. Bob, who do you prefer, Margot Robbie or Emily Blunt? I feel like the answer is Margot Robbie. I don't even, I can't even, I can't picture Emily Blunt in my head. Isn't Emily Blunt like way older? I wrote Mario Robbie. Yeah, it's almost like a 10 year difference. That's not fair. Shit. Oh, oh, please, please. Nice. Boop, beep, bop. Mm. I hate how happy this music is. That was the furthest I've gotten. Hello, Hotshot Lev. Hello. How are you? Can I get beep boop bop as a text message alert? <laughs> yes. Ah, oh, I hit the wrong button! This whole stream is gonna be one level. <laughs>
Oh, come on. Kawaii Face Miles, hello. My favorite e-girl looking handsome. We love that in here. Thank you. Thank you, Kawaii Face, for the sub. Flip. No, 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 no. Bob, can you give us a hint on what Will's video is going to be tomorrow? Uh, I have no idea what it is, and I need to ask him so I can make the thumbnail. Ha! I just realized I don't know why this popped into my head I forgot to give Will his Twitter banner when he showed up in my video today <laughs> forgot to give the little Twitter animation oopsies speaking of Twitter I'm almost at 30k beep boop come on baby beep. oh I almost did not make that come here you no Hands are so flipping sweaty. I checked there are no new ninja speed runs. Thank you. I actually looked as well. Uploading your personal channel soon? Yes. I wanted to edit a finish editing or get more editing done today. I'm hoping sometime this weekend or Monday or Tuesday. Hey Bob, I want to ask a serious question about your YouTube. One, about YouTube. One, how do you get most of your sponsors? Like, do they reach out to you? Two, if they do reach out to you, at, at about what general subscriber count does that start happening? Um, it's a mix between them reaching out to me, uh, just through my email that's linked to my YouTube. And also I'm under an MCN uh, and I have a manager that like either he gets solicited like like either the uh the sponsors reach out to the the MCN and they divvy it up among the YouTubers or my manager puts together like a like a bid and pitches it to sponsors um do not join an MCN then uh, until don't join an MCN. <laughs> it like they almost never actually get people sponsors. Uh, they'll still say that they're going to, and then they almost never do, unless you're like on the top of their list, you know. So I got very lucky with my current situation. But anyway, when does it start happening? Um, we got... My first sponsorship was, I think, Amino? Let's see something. Wolf Den Amino. It's going to be an old-ass video. So this might not have been the first sponsorship, but this was one of the first, maybe? Yeah, that's right. I like my own videos. What do you guys say about it? Uh, This is in December. So we started our YouTube channel in 2013. And this was in 2017. So it took a while. <laughs> but we... We were just under 100,000 subscribers. And this sponsorship barely paid anything. Um, yeah, we were probably at like 80 or 90,000 at that point.
Next question, probably, do you ever reach out to sponsors? Um, not really. I have tried to a bunch of times, and it's it's really hard to get their attention. The whole sponsorship game is really dumb. Because, you know, like, a lot of these companies, they have PR companies do the sponsorship outreach for them. So, like, they don't even... The company themselves don't even, like, deal with the influencers. So these PR companies, their job is to just get as many freaking sponsorships as they can. And they just want to see numbers, you know? They just want to be like, oh, this is how many uh, this is how many influencers we got with a collective total of this many subscribers. What the fuck just happened there? And like a lot of those PR companies, they, they like to look at average view count which sucks because our average view count is not good because we have a we have a bunch of different shows on our channel and not all of them do good you know fuck so my manager has to be like we're gonna put the sponsorship on a gaming video and it's gonna they all we're promising this many views, you know. But then the you know, like the PR person has to go to the company and say, This channel has an average view count of fifty thousand, but the the show that they're gonna put on have is as average view count of hundred thousand. And the PR guy has the option to like, explain all that to his boss or just go with somebody else. <laughs> you know what I mean? Does your dad say what YouTubers you should ask on a date? Both of my parents do. <laughs> and none of them are anybody that I would ever interact with professionally, you know? The last one, my dad, <laughs> my dad sent me a video on Facebook of, um, ah, oh, what's that, uh, that band? I saw them in Vegas. What the hell's their name? Postmodern Jukebox. They did Mario Brothers. So he sent it to me, it was like, you gotta send them an email. And write to so-and-so, like the girl from it. She'll get back to you. She gets back to everybody. Why do I got to do anything? Why do I got to do that? What am I going to do? Cool Mario Brothers thing you did. Hello, Mega Man. Oh, I got spin jump. Who they try and hook you up with, huh? <laughs> That's another thing. My dad will be like, you gotta hook up with this person. But he means, like, you gotta get in touch with. He doesn't mean you gotta, like, have sex with this person. But that's what it sounds like when he says you gotta hook up with this person. <laughs>
don't know how I never got hit by that. I never get hit by that spike there. But this fucking guy! This fucking guy! My dad says the same thing. Fucking boomers. Hello, small dog mom. Fuck! <laughs> I just yelled fuck at a little Pikachu like came out of my mouth. Somebody clip that. Somebody clipped a little Pikachu coming out of my mouth. <laughs> Boop! No! All right, after this, if I don't crush it right now. Fuck. All right, I gotta try to find that level that had a million lives. Was it hard to pick up chicks living in your parents' house at 28? I, I can't make my camera bigger because it'll get all fucked up. What makes you think that I even tried? <laughs> Being 28 living in my parents' house. What makes you think that I even gave it a chance? <laughs> How do I leave? Can I just leave? How do I leave? Can I not leave? Can I not go back? I don't know if I can go back. Hmm. Okay. Why didn't you try? I don't know, because I was fucking 28 living in my parents' house and my job was was making YouTube videos at the time to nobody. We'll meet his wife. We'll meet his wife. When did Will meet his wife? 2008? 2007? Sometime around then? Random question. Did you or your brother always do the channel together or did he join later? Uh, we always did it together. Um... The format has actually been almost exactly the same since it started. Whoop! Right, here we go, baby. Ah! Ooh! The first vid on the channel is one of Will's. Uh, so. I feel like I say this a lot. Um, at the time of the channel's inception, uh, 
I was working on a comic book because I wanted to be some sort of like digital illustrator or something. Anyway, I knew I wanted to do digital art in some way. I really had, I really wasn't focused on any one particular aspect, which is probably a, not a good thing. Um, so I was like, Will, you have a film degree and you don't do anything with it. You got to do something with it. All we do is watch YouTube videos. Why don't you make a YouTube channel? So then for like, after like two weeks, he was like, all right, I decided I wanted to start a YouTube channel, but I think you should do it with me. And I said, okay. Well, you know that I can't get involved with something. In, you, you know that I can't get involved into something without just fucking taking the whole thing over. <laughs> and then that's what happened. Why did I do that? So here's the thing. In, uh... In 2016... At the end of 2016, uh, I don't remember how far along my YouTube channel was. Um, but you know, it wasn't like bringing in any money or anything. Um, I was quitting my job at the end of 2016 at a graphic design job at a t-shirt company. Oh, I'm gonna shut up for a second. Fuck! I was quitting my graphic design job at a t-shirt company to work for this YouTube channel called Shoddy Cast. They were looking for a new show to pick up, and I pitched to them a show called The Art, which is all about the art of video games. So the idea was I would pick a different game every week and talk about how cool the art is and everything that went into it and stuff. Um... And it was going to be a weekly show. So I quit my job. Uh, my girlfriend at the time also broke up with me, so that was good. <laughs> um, then, very quickly, the weekly YouTube show turned into a bi-weekly YouTube show. Turned into a once-a-month YouTube show. Turned into... This YouTube channel is dying. <laughs> So I only uploaded like a couple of episodes. And also, ShoddyCast was mainly focused on Bethesda stuff, so they really wanted me to focus on Bethesda stuff for the art. And, you know, there's not many Bethesda games. So I quickly ran out of games to do. So I did Skyrim like a billion times, and there's only so many times you can talk about the art of Skyrim. Um, but also, also at the same time that I joined ShoddyCast, their main show, The Science, uh, got bought out by Game Theory. So Austin, who was the guy on that, who the guy who ran that show, he was the main guy on ShoddyCast and he moved to Game Theory. So now all of a sudden, the only show on ShoddyCast is the new guy. <laughs> so it didn't go over very well. So my new job with this YouTube channel quickly just fell apart. Um, luckily, that was the year the Nintendo Switch came out and our Nintendo Switch content was picking up really good. So I saw a lot of potential there. Uh, so I had time I had all this time, because I didn't have a fucking job, so I just focused really hard on the YouTube channel. Uh, and luckily it paid off. That year I made almost, I made, I made fucking no money. And thank God, you know, I was living at my parents' house, because I wouldn't have been able to afford to do that. Oh. 
Now, how am I supposed to, at that time, go pick up chicks and be like, hey, babe, this is my job. I work on the, I make videos for this dying YouTube channel, and I also make videos on this YouTube channel that is my last name and doesn't get any views, but it's picking up, and it will get a lot of views someday. Someday I will be able to move out and rent a nice apartment in Brooklyn. Come home with me. My mom will bake you pancakes in the morning. <laughs> also, can you give me money for for the bus? <laughs> I'm fucking broke as shit right now. <laughs> Bro, if I was a girl, I would say yes to that. No, you fucking wouldn't. You would be like, who is this crazy homeless person? Also, I left out, there was a long time. Uh, yeah, actually, at that same time, I was sleeping on the couch in the basement. You know the couch, the original Wolfden uh, live couch? That was my bed. <laughs> uh, because my sick elderly grandmother moved in with us, and my parents were like... There was like no conversation, it was just, all right, out you go, Bob. She needs the bed. She needs your room. So move somewhere else. <laughs> and I was just like, understandable. I get it. And I just fucking slept on the couch for like two years. Shit. Oh, I'm good. I'm good. Yes! Oh, mm. It's always the face of those little spinies. My parents taught me not to insult the homeless because anyone can be homeless. Am I, I'm calling myself homeless. Enough for nothing. I think I look like a homeless man. But you're right, anybody can be homeless because every, I heard that everybody is five steps away from being homeless. And I kind of believe that. Five might be a lot for some people. <laughs> I think I know some people who are like one or two steps away. This is not going well. This is not going well at all. Bob, you look like Jesus if you own a Switch. It wasn't Jesus. Well, he wasn't homeless. <laughs> what was in Will's room? Will, his, him. I don't know why the decision was made. Bob, get the fuck out. <laughs> I don't know why the decision was Will stays, you go, Bob. <laughs> I only have one life left.
<sighs> is Will straight? Are you fucking... Or you're being thirsty? <laughs> That's fucking awesome. He is married with a baby. <laughs> but that doesn't mean anything. It's 2020, dude. Who knows anymore? I sat so long watching stuff on my laptop that I lost the feeling in my butt. I feel like a lot of people can relate. <clears throat> I'm getting worse and worse at this. Uh, uh. Do you ever consider moving out of New York? No. I was talking to Wood about that, actually. Uh, I like New York too much. Australia. No, I like New York too much. It's expensive, but I'm willing to pay a premium to live somewhere cool or somewhere that I like. And I, I you know, I have family and friends over here. I got no reason to go anywhere else. And they're always, I like how there's always... I mean, I could have lived out on Long Island. I got more family and friends over there, you know? But, uh, I like being where there's shit going on, you know? Oh. Fuck. What's gonna happen here? Oh my god, thank you so much. Don't fall off the cliff. That would be horrible. <laughs> uh, please just end the level. Guys, I bet you didn't think we'd ever make it this far. <laughs> oh my god, man. I need to, I need to stretch. I need to like get this knot out of my back. Yeah. Oh, you need a chair needs to not have a back right now. Oh. Oh. Also, my body's all sore because I've been getting fucking swole. Look at these lanky ass arms. Can't even see. I don't even know how to use this cab right for. Lay on the floor and let Rue walk on it. Get out of here. I'm not even touching the controller. How did that happen?
My dad's asking me how to get a switch right now for one of his friends. <laughs> Actually, wait, I, I, oh yeah, I thought maybe there would be some colors on Amazon. There's not a gray switch light for 278. That is not correct. <sighs> You looking to get a VR headset? No, I'm not. Half-Life Alex intrigues me. Once I saw the first episode on your channel, I was like, well, thank you, Edward. When are you going to play Minecraft again with the guys? Uh, I'm trying to set up Monopoly with the guys this Thursday, but of course, MDB is the last one to say anything. I'll sell him mine for the Wolf Den Dad price of $600. There better be two switches in there. I think GameStop still has a Switch Lite online bundle. Let's see. GameStop.com. I could show this without revealing anything, right? Yeah. Nintendo Switch. Uh... I feel like this is not going to be in stock. Oh. They straight up have the turquoise one. What about this? Not available. Not available. Was I wrong? Did this, this said it was available, right? Add to cart. Dude. I'm going to send this to him. They have Monopoly on Switch for uh, for ten dollars in the eShop right now. Is it? It's freaking forty dollars normally. Yeah, ten dollars. That's the price it should be. Other than Asphalt 9, what game, loft game have you played? Uh, a lot of the modern combat games. Uh, I've played other Asphalt games, I think. They had a Halo knockoff. What was that called? I actually applied for a job at Game Loft way back in the day when I thought I could be a concept artist. <laughs> With zero experience. <laughs> Nova, that was the one. I did one concept art job once for, uh, it was for two, 2K games made an offshoot comic book company called Take Two. No. Okay, Take Two made an offshoot comic book company called Double Take. The idea was that these comic books would then inspire video games to be made out of them uh and i was part of like a group of people to just draw some concepts for some stories that they had but it was so it was such a weird experience because we like went into some conference room that they rented out from some random place uh and we had to draw in front of them and all of my stuff they, they had my portfolio pulled up like what they wanted me to draw like 
and all of the things that they showed were um, pieces that I used a lot of reference material for. <laughs> and they expected me to draw like... And, and the things that they pulled up took me hours. And they expected me to draw that stuff in just a couple of minutes with no reference material in front of them with them watching. It was very strange. I wonder if I could, I probably could find it, but that stuff is embarrassing to look at now. <laughs> All right, let's do this. All right, you want me to find it? Let's find it. Let's, let's see if I can grab it. I know I can grab it. I don't know what I'm, I haven't looked at it in forever. I don't think I was able to actually put it in my portfolio. Or I don't think I wanted to. Um, Oh, you know what? They took a lot of the stuff, I think. This is I'm not showing this. This is terrible. <laughs> I'm not showing this. Oh my god. I have reference photos and it's like me with my shirt off. All right, cool. What else we got? <laughs> Go back, go back, go back. Where's the actual drawing? Oh, this file is probably massive. I don't remember this at all. All right, well, this is, <laughs> so, okay, so what happened, so I had to do a bunch of drawings there in front of them, and they were horrible, and I'm not going to show those, um, but then they, like, sent this home, and they were like, spend, like, just a couple hours doing, like, a painting, and we'll bill you for that, but don't spend any more than just a couple hours, so I was like, but I want to spend more than a couple hours, because I want it to look good, but I also don't want to get ripped off. So this was in 2013. I don't remember what exactly they wanted. But this was just, see, you got some fucking deer, you got a dude, and you got some girls like naked and washing her hair. I don't know, it's called Savannah. I don't know anything about this. Let me see if I could pull up one of the things that they actually... Um, let me see if I can find like the piece of my portfolio that they were like, do this. He has a drawing of an old Western looking guy that is just Will. That's just Will. That's just a picture of Will. Right? <laughs> that was 2012. Hmm. 
Hmm. Looking for one thing in particular. I literally have a folder under in my illustrations folder called babes. <laughs> And it's just like pin up drawings and stuff. What is this? Hmm. Oh, is this it? Yes, I found it. I don't know why the fuck this has a sci-fi logo on it. But this was some like, this was one of the things they were like, do this, but do it in like, you know, an hour and we want to watch you do it. <laughs> I don't know why the sci-fi logo is in the corner. <laughs> I don't get it. Look at the dog though. Look at that dog. best part right there all right anyway when what, what year was that when was the actual drawing done twenty twelve or twenty thirteen I don't know That was actually my friend's dog, uh, Samson was his name. He was the fucking best dog. It would be cool if you occasionally streamed you drawing like thumbnails for your videos or something. I don't know. I'm just spitballing. <laughs> Bob's in the wrong... Well, that's what I wanted to do, was I wanted to do concept art, but I... Bare like, that was the only, like, actual concept art that I had. I needed to do a lot more shit like that. What the fuck am I supposed to do here? Someone's gonna fall. Right? Oh, I'm so dumb. Fuck. It's gonna be one of those levels, huh? What did you go to? What did you go to college for graphic design? Yes. Were you asking if I went to college for graphic design? Because that's what I did. <laughs> I remember my senior year, which was like the sixth year I was in college. Um, I had a class called Career and Portfolio, which was mandatory, and it was supposed to uh, show you how to build a portfolio for the job that you want, you know, given the, uh, given the degree that you have. So everybody was working on all these graphic design portfolios. There were people who wanted to get into like package design and like, you know, magazine layout stuff. And I don't know, I'm just making shit up. Web design. 
So they, they would make their portfolio for that. And the teacher would go around the room and like, you know, help them out with that. Uh, and I wanted to do digital illustration uh, and like, you know, concept art and comic books and shit. Uh, oh, I got to hit him. And my teacher was like, well, I don't know anything about that. <laughs> He's like, all I know is uh, I've ran agencies before and we just hired illustrators. So you got to make an illustration portfolio, but that's, that's on you. So fucking figure it out. And I was like, okay. So I had to make a, an illustration portfolio by myself basically. And everybody, we did one project in that class that spanned the whole semester. And, and it would be like a project, like if you wanted to go into package design, you would make a package design. If you want to go into web design, you would make a web design to like, you know, show off your skills. So I made a comic book. Fuck. And the teacher would go around the room and like help everybody like with their work. And then he'd get to me and he'd be like, uh, you're on your own, buddy. <laughs> Why does that? I feel like Yoshi's supposed to bounce there. Sounds familiar? What do you mean sounds familiar? What are you talking about? Where did you go to college? I went to SUNY Farmingdale. There you go, that's what I need to do. Ah! Oh, I might have been able to save that. Mario Odyssey is only 50 at Target right now. Is that normal? No, it's usually 60. So I went to Farmingdale. This is like all about just my my fucking life right now. I was not a good student. Fuck. I was not a good student. Uh, and I wanted to get into uh, computer networking. Because <laughs> I figured that's where, I like computers. And there's money in that. And everybody needs a network engineer. Uh, and basically the only college I can get into that wasn't uh, community college was Farmingdale. And it was right by my house. Uh, fuck. And I got in... I got in there as undeclared because I couldn't get into the uh, the IT like department. So my idea was to get in there as undeclared, and then I was gonna take a bunch of programming classes and stuff, and then do well enough in those to like then get into the networking like track. But. I did absolutely fucking terrible. <laughs> I flunked out of like two of the programming classes or something. And there was all these math classes I had to take and they were fucking terrible. Um, so then I was like, well, I, I don't want to do this anymore. What else do they got? I was like, well, <laughs> no, what else do I got? It was either uh, IT shit or art. I never thought in my brain to put the two together. <laughs> and the only uh, art degree that they had there, because it was a business school, was graphic design. So I was like, all right, I'll try it. And I took a, I took a typography class. And I was like, this is, gonna, this is fucking literally just talking about fonts. This is going to suck. And it was awesome. And I loved it. And I was like, all right, I'm going to, this is what I'm going to do. And I switched my major. And it was great.
And I was still a horrible student until my senior year or my junior year. Where all my classes were graphic design classes and I was a fucking great student. I need the shell! What's your fave font? Uh, right now, Gotham. All the Wolfden branding is Gotham. Fuck. It used to be Futura, but that was just a little, it was a little sharp. I like Sans Serifs. I'm a little out of practice. <laughs> Wood was actually asking me yesterday. Basics. Get the fuck out of here. What's your favorite font? Oh, yeah, you're a graphic designer, aren't you? What's your favorite font? Fucking Badoni? Fucking Mrs. Eves over here? Fuck. Wood was like, are you one of those guys that can, like, name a font by looking at it? I was like, probably... I used to be like that. I don't think I could do that anymore. Unless it's, like, a popular font. Oh my god, what?! I like Arial Black now. Talk about basic bitch. Batman Forever font. <laughs> I like the, the Spider-Man 2 font. realize that that goes out from under me. Nothing beats Calibri. <laughs> Sounds like I'm joking, but there's not. There's one called Unicorn, and I like it a lot. Papyrus, you shut the fuck up, small dog mom. That is not your favorite font. There's a store called Papyrus, and the font is not Papyrus. I forgot what font it is. I have a tweet about it, where I, I, where I named the font. But I don't remember what font it was. <laughs> okay, here we go. Ah! I could just jump back, probably. Damn it. I'm reading the chat too much. Times New Roman, baby. How about just times? How about that? When was the switch from graphic designer to content creator? That was uh, the, the end of 2016 and all of 2017. <laughs> I did a little bit of freelance Ooh, in, fuck. I did a little bit of freelance in 2017 because I wasn't making any money. People are yelling at each other outside. What the fuck? Pretty sure there's still one more world after this. <laughs> OK, 
Okay, here we go. Over here. Uh, I'm not gonna make it. Uh, what? I think I'm supposed to just... Hold up. Like, I'm not gonna get hit. I'm just being a bitch. Hey, what up, Waldem? Bob, stop being a bitch. I'm trying. I ain't say which font I like. There are two I go between, so no favorites. I don't think LOL, but two are just pretty good. Cursive writing one, I'm lost for the name. And comics, oh my god, don't tell me you... you don't tell me you're doing comics, and man. Even when I was lettering comic books, I had a different font. I think it was called Marvel. I wouldn't use Comic Sans. Oh! Ice! What made you want to change all of the Wolf Den branding? Because I'm a graphic designer and I fucking just... I, the, the original plan was to change the branding every year because I like doing branding. And then sometime in like 2017, 2018, I was like, we need a logo that's not our faces. Uh, that will last a long time. So I just spent like a shit ton of time working on that. And I'm happy I did. And now it hasn't changed for two years. Now I barely have time to mess with it. I really want to do more apparel. That's my next move. Dude, I'm like a pixel away, man. Here's a tough question for you. What's the worst font in the world? The worst font in the world. I'm trying to think of like logos that don't make any sense. Like a meme font or a real font. I'm trying to think of like a like a, just a font that just nobody should ever use for any reason ever. Like a font that when I see it, I'm like, no. Get away from me. Helvetica? No, Helvetica is great. Walsh man, thank you for the 500 bits. Now we can see if my stupid alerts work. Marker felt. Marker felt. That's like when you see someone... When someone screenshots something on their phone, like a text message, and they have, like, marker felt as their default system font, you're like, wait, I can't read anything that you have. Like, I've lost in the meme. I'm too distracted by your garbage thing. What do I... I really have no idea what to do there. I gotta... Do I gotta get rid of that icicle?
Trojan Pro is one of is one that is used unironically. Trajan, I I'm stupid. Oh yeah, this is like the I don't I I couldn't picture the song. This is like, you know, restaurant menu font or fake marble sign font. Uh, Aiden, thanks for gifting a sub to Waldem. 111 gift subs to the channel? Jesus Christ. Look, my alerts work. Isn't that great? Jump over the falling icicle, then enter the door. Jump over the falling icicle. I tried that. The first icicle breaks on the second icicle, and then you can't get in the door. Try the two tunnels to the right before hitting the on-off switch. Oh, you mean the pipes? After landing on the first, then jump to the second. I did that. I'll try it again. Okay, I'll just hit it from the bottom. Jump onto the second one. I did that, and I fucking couldn't get in the thing. Unless it was just a fluke. See? That shit happens. Treble Steinberg. There you is. You were the top bit donator today, but I forgot to restart the thing. So you got cut out, buddy. Ah, fuck. Thank you for gifting all those subs. Thank you for the five gifted subs of Ghostman 93, Agathoran, Silver Light Fox, Goth Lushy, and Metalhead. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Throw the shell at the ice. You don't need the one on or off switch. What? Yes, I do. Do I not? Let's see. Oh, you're right. Uh, so I do this. <laughs> I don't think the shell kills it. Fuck, I missed it. <laughs> Good thing that's there. right about me not needing this but then what do I do with this
Can you go down the pipes? I tried that. Bounce off the wall and jump onto it into the door. Now, that is definitely not the answer because there's been no shell jumps this whole world. And I really hope there's not one now. God damn it. Meow. Well. Bob, have you seen the TikTok of the kids spilling milk and cereal all over the subway fucking with essential workers? No. Why is he fucking with... Oh, well, the essential workers are the people who have to clean it up, right? I didn't... So I heard about it, and I saw, like, a picture of it, uh, or, like, a quick glimpse of it on the Philip DeFranco show. Uh, fuck that kid. But he's done other dumb shit like that, where he just makes a mess of the subway. Bob, do you want to design my next tattoo? No. <laughs> that sounds like a lot of work. I used to be super into doing people's tattoos, and I was terrible at it. Uh, but I liked the idea of it. Ooh. How did I get the life and make it up on the platform? I need to do that every time. Jump on the first icicle and then dip back instantly to the pipes, then go to the top. So look, look, I'll show you. They break each other. No, they don't break each other. Oh, they can respawn. So let's watch it again. So it hits it right at the moment I need to get into the fucking thing. Is there a way I can... No, I can't bait it. I can... I can knock this one down, probably. Nope. If I do this... Okay. Then I'll, I'll just go away. I think I need to just nail this. No, that was terrible. Is there a way I can activate the second one without activating the first one? Ooh, wait, I have an idea. I have a stupid idea. That just might be stupid enough to work. Get ready for my... Okay. I was just gonna... Duck. <laughs> my stupid idea was I was just gonna fucking duck. Until the last second. Bob, have you stopped drawing art entirely? No. The only... I mean, I do graphic design shit all the time. Like, layout design stuff all the time. Uh, but, I mean, it's all for the channel, though. Um, but the only actual illustration I do is the thumbnails for Wolf Den Live. And I do, I, I force myself to do that because I don't want to lose that, like, I don't want to lose that, you know? I want to be able to have that. It's a cool thing to be able to do. Fuck. Ah! That was it. Don't jump so high. Oh, that is dumb. That sucks. I hate that. Oh, the checkpoint wasn't even there. Ah! Uh. But anyway, yeah. Drawing the thumbnails for Wolf Den Live feels like a waste of time. I, I'm also trying to develop a style where I can do them really quickly and still, like, be happy with the drawing. Okay, I'm dead. Ah! Time. Thank you for the Twitch Prime sub. F is right. Now you can use the real F. Fuck. <laughs> Often live thumbnails look amazing though. Thanks, man. They take me like fucking three hours. Oh, 
you know, it's time I should be spending making videos. I'm trying to develop like a nice manga style because I like the ink. I like the comic booky, inky like style, but they also have to be colored because YouTube thumbnails, they need to pop a little bit. That's why I put like a color wash over it. I need to pee and take a step away from this game for two seconds. Uh, should I put something on while I'm gone? Oh, this is a classic right here. Need for this Steve. is a freaking classic. Crisis. Chris Mackey. And then Grim Fairy. So you, you might want to nope, spell it, it way wrong. But... Oh, wait. Is it? No. Nope. Close. Just a K Ooh, after the C there. Okay, there he is. Back. See, look. He's on Last FM. Last FM, okay. That's he why it's called. He is the Last yeah. FM. <laughs> Whoa. He's <laughs> one of these guys. <laughs> Which he could be either, and neither scenario is good. <laughs> Ooh, no. He doesn't have a lot there. Um, uh -oh. He's got five listeners, though. He's got 14 scrabbles. <laughs> I don't know what that means. Trade in those Scrabbles for prizes. <laughs> what the fuck are Scrabbles? <laughs> 14 Scrabbles all time. <laughs> Five listeners. <laughs> Chris. Hold on. The data just came back. Oh. <laughs> you get 14 Scrabbles. <laughs> Hold on. Search for, search for like... Uh, like Katy Perry, I want to see how many Scrabbles she has to compare. You know, no, I want to see how many Scrabbles. Not with EY. It's not EY. That's totally her. No, it's it's Y. Just... Now she has 114 <laughs> Scrabbles. Wait, wait, search somebody popular. Search Kanye West. I saw him. There. Not Kane West. <laughs> Kanye West. I spelled it right. Jeez. Where are those oh, Scrabbles? Oh my God! Look at all those Scrabbles. <laughs> oh my God! I wonder why less to fit. Because they're calling them Scrabbles. What, what do you mean we're losing to Spotify? Yeah, what? We got all these Scrabbles. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> That's some bullshit some executive made up. <laughs> the Scrabbles. <laughs> yeah, they're going crazy for these Scrabbles. Boss, why don't we just call them plays? Scrabbles is what they're going to be called. <laughs> okay. We got kids. Kids in high school, they're going to go... Yay, you, I just scrabbled. <laughs> I just scrabbled to Chris Mackey last night. You should really check him out. How oh can boy. we scrabble this? I need to. I, I don't think you can play it. You have to log into Scrabble. Really? Yeah, yeah. They're hey. not going to let anyone come into their website, scrabble away. They're scrabbling all over. Yeah, yeah. So you got verified scrabblers and unverified scrabblers. <laughs> I it's noticed just a flat line. It, it's weird. <laughs> I noticed I had a spike in Scrabbles in July of 2018. That's weird. What do you think accounted for all those extra Scrabbles? Ooh, none of this, this is all I can buy on eBay. All right, 8,600 Scrabbles. That's oh, a lot that's, better. That's, better. that's more it, what I was thinking. <laughs> the number like, of Scrabbles they should have. Why would they call it Scrabbles? It doesn't make. Like, is it like a... It's, it's just what the kids are saying. Is it like, a, like when you scribble a disc? Is that what it is? Like, is that something? Is, isn't that like when you like ever a scribble DJ? a disc? Isn't that like when you, know, like you do this? Like you do the... Scratching? Oh, that's called scratching. So. I mean, sometimes, you know, when we're trying to say something and you or I like just go like, blah, 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 yeah, yeah, and our yeah, brains just fart. Yeah. I think that just happened during a meeting. But then they kept Instead it? Instead of subscribers, they said scrabble. <laughs> Scrabblers? <laughs> no, the other guys are like, just write, the CEOs. Scrabblers. just write it down. I'm having a heart attack. <laughs> Scrabblers! Somebody call it. Scrabblers! <laughs> Somebody call it Scrabbler! Chad Muska's pro skater is an extremely. Shut up, donkey. Ow. Matt, you guys don't remember Scrabblers?
I'll throw away channel points if you put one of my songs on. <laughs> I could, I wanted to do channel points as media share, but uh, Streamlabs doesn't let you do that. Dude. You can only do media share with uh, actual dollars donated. Look at all those scrabblers! I think when I <laughs> next sub milestone, I'm gonna pre ah, I jumped too high. Fuck. Next sub milestone, I'm gonna be like, thanks for all the scrabbles, guys. <laughs> and I'll have it photoshopped as a last FM like page. I don't even need to do that. The media show will go crazy if it was points. I would make it pretty high, like a pretty high amount of channel points. But part of the reason why I wanted to be channel points instead of money is that uh, I think if you're forced to be in the chat, like as a member of the community, what the fuck? <laughs> if you're forced to be here, with using your own time, uh, chances are you like know the deal and you're not some fucking idiot trying to troll, you know what I mean? I'm sure you've heard the Nintendo rumors lately. What do you think they will announce? I am all in on a Mario 64 remake. Yeah, it didn't shoot out a life at all. Ah, oh, fuck, I didn't want to do that. We're good, we're good. Ah, oh, here we go. Don't move! Yup! Yeah! Ooh! Alright, boys, here we go. What? Oh, God! Ha! What am what what am I supposed to? Am I supposed to hit him that way and jump off of him twice? Let's try. Oh, I gotta tap. I gotta tap it. Well, this isn't gonna fucking be easy. Oh, you can skip him. Shit, dude. I don't even think this is the last world. Fuck. Ah! Ah! <laughs> Ooh. Oh my god, was that it? Ah! God damn it. I have you running on my laptop, phone, tablet, and even the Switch. These points came coming easy. We'll keep racking them in. One day we'll have channel points do something. What should they do? What should channel points do? I wish you could fucking just straight up get a sub. not throw it there. What? Game overs take you all the way to the start of the level. Yep. 
That's all they really do is uh, get rid of the checkpoint. And some of these, like the last level had like four checkpoints. That's ridiculous. Okay, fuck this. Don't need you. Ha! Could be like Greg's and let us mother you telling you to, ch no, I don't want to do that. Physical stuff? No. That's impossible, but I get your point. What's the max amount of checkpoints? Is it three? It had a lot of checkpoints, I'm trying to say. Two? How many fucking checkpoints did that last one have? <laughs> it had four different sections. I guess maybe it only had two checkpoints. <laughs> Get out of here. Fuck are you. Okay. Hi. Ooh. Okay, here we go, baby. Fuck! How did I get an extra life there? Beep! 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 What is this? What is this? Ah, oh, I jumped too high! Oh! See, no checkpoint. Fuck this, dude. Keep! Heap! Heap! Ah, oh, and there's no checkpoint! Oh, kinda like that. Kinda like this part. Bob, why are you hating on Clubhouse games? I'm not! It's just a little ridiculous, don't you think? Okay, we're good. We're good, right? Ah, eep, eep. See, now I don't know what to do there. How the fuck am I supposed to know what to do there without dying once? When is Clubhouse Games coming out? Because that'll have to be a stream. Come on, man. For X amount of points, you gotta play our levels. I almost did viewer levels today, but then I was like, you know what? I wanna give people a fair warning when I'm gonna do that. So next week sometime, expect viewer levels. <laughs> what is in that pipe? Something's in that pipe. Eep, eep, eep. How come I didn't jump off of him a second time? Early June. Wow, that's actually very soon. Are most of Bob's streams just him screaming sound effects? Ah, uh, the Mario Maker ones. No, they all are. Except when I'm playing Call of Duty. Yeah, I'm screaming, uh... There's two of them? On me, on me? Ooh. Mamma mia! Fuck! Forgot the spin jump. How many points for Bob to beat Ocarina of Time, finally? Zero. Oh, that was too high, maybe? Eep! Ooh. One of these times I gotta see if there's something in that pipe. Come on! I didn't even touch that! I 
hit the button. I hit the fucking button. Boop. Boop. I had to see. I just had to see. Boop. Boop. Bob, stop the stream and watch Spider-Verse. That I should do. That I should definitely do. Okay. Oh, I just let it, I just fall. man all right bob i'm out good luck with the next level next week viewer levels i'll work i'll get to work then have a good night and stop fucking watch spider verse you got it my friend Like sometimes get a jump off of that second one. You play viewer levels? Uh, not normally. Fuck. Oh, I did it. Did not think I was gonna make that. Whoop! Bob, how's the dog tonight? He is good. He he got a he got a shave yesterday. It's not looking too good. <laughs> not looking too good. There you go. Why? I think I have to spin jump on it. But there should be a Z there then. Is Humble Bundle a good deal? It usually is. Let it pass and then jump on it. Will it let me ride it? I don't think it will. And how am I supposed to let it pass? I'm falling on a platform. What do Amiibos do in Mario Maker? They do absolutely nothing in this one. Fuck. I still think there's a whole nother world after this. <laughs> I'm not entirely sure. Yep, there's a whole nother world after this.
Ah! They still haven't added amino amiibo functionality. They're not gonna. Was on top of the shell, man. Ever itch to play Overwatch? Not really. Uh, I used to play it a decent amount. What the fuck? It's great. I like Overwatch. Bob, how many channel points to... What the fuck? To get a doggo stream. Problem is... Dog's not always around, you know? Dog's very busy. Very busy dog. Am I supposed to just land on him? Like, softly land on it? I'm gonna try that. Have you played dungeon style levels? Sorry for repeating this question. No, no, that, uh, that, I need that. Everybody gets two. If I miss it the first time, say it a second time. And then if I miss it the second time, it's probably because I didn't want to answer it. Uh, fuck. Um, I have. I have played dungeon style levels. What about them? I prefer levels like this where it takes you like a million tries to figure it out. This one's a little too fucking hard though. <laughs> I get a little easier than this. Fuck. Ah, is that too high? Nope. Keep! Falling off at any moment. Okay. Flip! Man, you look good with your hair up. What are you trying to say, man? How you doing? Darth Snugglepuss. <laughs> Eep! I'm just going to fall on it. I think I got a spin jump on it. My super world is all about that concept, but if you don't enjoy them, I'll rather not descend levels. I do want to play your super world. That sounds great. Twenty five K channel points for your largest meep? Largest in terms of volume or in length? What are we talking here? What are the logistics of this meep? Boys, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to beat this level. <laughs> it's been fun, it's been rad. I ain't no quitter. But god damn it, I think. <laughs> I think I'm fucking having it having enough here. Oh, 
Look at the progress we've made on it, though, you know? Beep! Can I still be a cute boy even though I'm a girl? Yeah, that's... Uh, cute boy! That term transcends gender, okay? What is gender, anyway? It's 2020. It's not even a thing anymore. According to Twitter. Fuck! But Pop is forever the cutest boy of them all. You're goddamn right. You're goddamn right. Did your female stickers increase with AC stuff? I think they did. But I have no proof of it. Okay, what am I gonna do? Spin jump. Ha! What? Okay, that's what I gotta do. I just gotta commit. I didn't know it was gonna disappear. I thought I'd be able to like, hop on it. Fuck me. People are really starting to think this Mario Remaster collection is coming. Yeah, I think so. I don't know if it's gonna be a collection though. God! I would bet a lot of money that they're remaking or remastering Super Mario 64. I don't know about um, a remaster, because it does need a lot of work. Ah, fuck. Oh, I did it. I didn't do it. Sunshine 2. See, now that just needs a... Fuck. That just needs a remaster. Okay, we're good. We're good. My money's on sunshine. Why can't it be both? What's stopping it from being both? Come on, baby. All right, here we go. Why? All right, so don't hit that. What is this, fucking Mega Man 1? Some trolley bullshit going on here. Not about it. Sometimes I just phase through it. Keep contemplating buying a GameCube just to play some old games. When do we think this is happening? End of the year. What is the hitbox on these guys? <sighs> I 
Am I the only one who thinks 64 is a weird title name? Odyssey, Galaxy, and Sunshine. Yeah, but everything. Ugh, everything for the N64 was 64. Everything for the Super Nintendo was super. You know? Just how it is. Hello, Warco. God damn it. Fuck. I need to, I need to take a second. Sega should remake the adventure games. It has the same camera problem as Mario 64. It does. Um, bloody thank you for the three months word um uh sonic adventure 2 is amazing it's great it's a great platformer its biggest problem is that it came out a few months before mario sunshine uh, and Mario Sunshine fixed the camera problem for 3D platformers. So it immediately dated uh, Sonic Adventure 2. Because Mario Sunshine, as far as I know, is the first 3D platformer with a free look rotating right analog stick. And then nobody really played Sonic Adventure 2 until it came out on the GameCube. And everybody was already playing fucking Sonic, uh, uh, Super Mario Sunshine. So it was like, well, fuck, this game sucks. <laughs> I like the adventure game stories. Yeah, I want a Sonic Adventure 3. I would love that. Ah, fuck. Oh, we're good. Oh, don't hit that. Fuck! <laughs> I would suffer through a game as bad as Sonic Forces just to see out the Sonic Adventure 3 story. To be honest. God! Played Sonic Veg 2 Battle a lot. Uh, almost got Green Hill Zone. No, I... I did. I... 100% I, of that shit. Sega should get the IDW writers for a Sonic game. Sega should do a lot of things. Pretty sure it's Sega Japan that works on like the main Sonic games. They need to let the Sonic Mania people just go fucking nuts. Fuck! Ah, oh, we're good. Oh. Okay. Ah, I gotta go all the way to the right. Bob, when playing this level, hit the on-off switch. 
Oh. Oh. Well, I already fucked it up. <laughs> <coughs> I see what you. S yes, I was. I'm. F I'm fucking up the level because I'm not hitting the the first on-off switch. You're right. You're right. You're right. You right. Shut up. Shut your face. I gotta be like a little to the left. I honestly would kill for even just a remastered version of Sonic Adventure. I would love a remaster of Sonic Adventure, of the Sonic Adventure series. The problem is that they have to get to one first. <laughs> I want Sonic Adventure 2. Really, I want a third one. I just want a Sonic Adventure 3. All right, so I'm going to hit that. Ah, f come on. I gotta just land on the ice cube. Oh shit, that was too high. Oh, now we're good. Ooh, don't slide too much. All right, I hit the thing. These fucking things. The big things in this game have just wrong hitboxes. Yeah, Apex and Warzone are too demanding on it in graphics. You know, I'm not going to talk right now. <laughs> there we go. Jesus Christ. Ah. Ah. Just end the level, please. Oh, fuck me. Should have been a life there. What? Oh, give me those. Give me those. I don't know. Why was I going for those? I assume I have to hit those on-off switches. Oh, no. That's good. I need to grab all those lives. That's good. I'm just going to farm those lives for a while. Ah. <sighs> They need Apex and Warzone on the Switch. So here's... I think they could do it. I don't think they're that demanding. I think they could totally do it. Um, I don't know what that does. What does the on-off switch do? Oh, I have to hit it under him. Wow, and I have a really short time limit. Thank God for these lives, though. I was looking to see if I can get a tablet that has comparable um, specs to the Nintendo Switch. But they're all Android tablets. I want a Windows tablet so I can just play games on Windows and see if they run, you know? Because I have a suspicion that you can just fucking get games like Apex and shit to run on Windows. Like, low spec Windows tablets. Oh, come on. There we go. End the level, please. 
Oh, yes. Will, will this save my lives? That would be nice. We beat two levels today. <laughs> oh, holy shit. I like this world a lot. So how many levels are in the next world? Wow. The fuck is that? What is that? Frogman. So we got one, two, three, four. Okay. It's gonna be hard as hell. But we'll save that for another time. Uh, let's go to more info so everybody can even see what his stuff is. If you want to play it yourself. The idea is right, is right here. All right, uh, I guess I gotta raid my friends. Here you go. Let me get on Discord real quick. Maybe he's coming up. Are you guys staying on for a minute? Yes. Okay. Are you coming to play with us? I'll play a few rounds. Oh, yes. 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 We're doing pretty pretty okay with this one guy. Ooh. All right, everybody, go watch Jerry. Uh, hey, I'll, come I'm gonna, watch me. I'm going to play Call of Duty with him for two seconds. Hey, Triton, what's up? Come on, come on. Oh, there's a mine. There's a mine right there. Maybe he'll come out now. Uh, boop. All right. Everybody go. You know the drill. Every time I raid somebody, you have to just say hi. That's your only obligation. You don't have to stay and watch. You just have to say hi. And then you can go about your business, okay? I'm going to play, like, a round or two of Call of Duty with him. Uh, and then I'll see you all tomorrow for Wolf Den Live. How about that? Goodbye, everybody. Make sure you say hi.